After months of preparations and battle for the few available slots to represent Kenya at the Africa Kickboxing Championship, a final squad of just over 10 players was selected today and will head to Cameroon later this month for the Continental Championship set to be held from the 19th to 24th of this month in Yaoundé, Cameroon. The Kenyan team boasts of a handful of talented players who have won medals at Continental events including the All-Africa Games. I think there are good reasons to expect them to, to perform well. First of all, because they've gone through a very rigorous uh, selection process. We've had about four or five championships. And so if somebody is going to represent a category, we can be assured that he's going to bring us a medal. The team is expected to begin a training camp as soon as possible to polish their skills for the remaining two weeks before heading to Cameroon for the championship, which has attracted teams from over 20 African nations. The Kenyan team is, however, in dire need of financial assistance as they require about 4.5 million shillings to cater for their travel expenses. Once we are uh, supported, you know the only problem is the support from the government. Uh, the players uh, and uh, the team, all, uh, plus the coaches, all of us are well prepared and we are ready for anything that is uh, ahead of us. Because most teams in Africa have really prepared well. We have, we've also prepared well, but our selection has become late because of the uh, funding, which we are also appealing to the government to at least come and support us so that we can go and uh, bring uh, glory back to the country. The challenge would be that we don't have enough to be able to send the 20. Out of the budget of about uh, 4.5 million, we have on our side 2 million. We need another 2.5 million, which we hope uh, we can get from either the government or other well-wishers so we can take the team. Kenya will only be represented by one lady in Cameroon, with the Kenya Kickboxing Federation requesting more ladies to try out the sport that has been dominated by male players over the years in the country. The team has set a target of winning medals in all the seven categories.